Thank you to Surfshark for sponsoring this video. Surfshark is an app and browser extension that allows you to change your IP address and access blocked content that you otherwise wouldn't have access to, alongside providing anonymity for the average consumer. Most, if not all, websites collect your data, sell it to other businesses, and track your digital habits, which feels invasive for many people. Plus, if there's ever a data breach on those website servers, your information is compromised with little responsibility falling upon the companies themselves that collected your data in the first place. I personally like Surfshark because I can access international soap operas from Latin America, and I enjoy the feeling of anonymity it provides where I don't feel constantly monitored by data trackers. You can also stay safe on public Wi-Fi when on the go with Surfshark. Get an exclusive Surfshark VPN holiday season deal when you use my discount code Angelica ASMR to get an extra six additional months for free at Surfshark. There's no risk with a 30-day month back guarantee, and if you love Surfshark service enough, you might want to consider their full Surfshark One package, which includes its own data leak protection, private search engine, and antivirus software. Try Surfshark today with my code down in the description box below, and thank you once again to Surfshark for sponsoring this video. On to the video. Um, it says in my system that you swallowed four tech decks. That's not healthy. When did this happen? Uh-huh, last night. How did this happen? As, as many details as you can give, it would be very appreciative. Appreciate it. Oh, I see. Right. Okay. Yeah. You heard that it was a good source of fiber? No. 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 That's very unhealthy for you. Um, I'm going to just sort of tap down your esophagus and I'm just gonna see if I can feel the protrusions in your system. Um, if I can't feel it, I would highly appreciate you telling me at which spot feels a little bit sore so that way I can kind of tell where the tech decks are, okay? We're a little bit concerned about the tech decks being in your digestive system, mostly because um, if your stomach acid can't burn it down, which we have our questions about, you will have to crap out the tech decks. And if it goes horizontally, not like feet first, but like oblong, um, you might tear through your sphincter four times. That's not healthy. So I'm just gonna tap down onto your esophagus and you tell me if you can feel it, okay? okay. It's not in your throat. It's the upper chest. Middle chest, lower chest, stomach. You don't feel any tension, any protrusion. Okay, so in that case, I'm gonna be using a little tool of mine just to detect any heat that might have built up in your digestive system, in your esophagus, in your entire, um, and then see if, um, I can find it that way, okay? So stay still for me, I'm just going to go and scan your body real quick, going upward, scan it up a little bit, okay, yeah, um, so, you said you wanted to have a little bit of fiber in your diet, right? Yeah, okay. I'm gonna just take your temperature real quick, just to make sure that your vitals are all doing well right now. If you wouldn't mind just lifting up your tongue for me, please. Mm. Lift up your tongue. Thank you. Lower your tongue. Thank you. Close your mouth. Thank you. I'm just gonna take your temperature real quick. Please don't speak. Okay. Okay, and, okay, let me see. Your temperature's doing quite well. Um, would you say that this is the first time you've tried doing something like this? No. Um, when, when would you say was the first time? 
2011? Ah, I see. Um, has it happened any time in between 2011 and now? Many times. What happened in all of those cases? Ah, I see. Um, well, unfortunately, for some unfortunate reason, you, it didn't go well this time. So I am going to give you a little bit of anesthesia and then I'm going to be cutting through your digestive system to find the tech decks. No, I won't be putting you under. Um, first of all, the economy. Second of all, um, I feel like a man who eats four tech decks can handle being cut open alive and watching those tech decks get pulled out of them. Mm hmm Yeah. Yeah. So, I'm just gonna get you a little bit of anesthesia. for where I'm going to cut. So I'm just going to go. Okay, okay, okay. <clears throat> Are you ready? Ooh. I'm just going to... Okay, ready? You could put your... You could put your hand on my shoulder if you need to. Yeah, just... Put your hand on my shoulder for comfort. You're taking it quite well. Okay. Now let me just sort of feel through your system. See what it is that you saw. I think it, I feel something. It feels plasticky. Okay. Xbox controller. You ate it whole. How? You, you thought you needed some green in your diet? You do understand that that means vegetables, right? No. Outdated technology does not constitute vegetation. It's... It... No. No. Um... Microplastics, micro, micro, yes, everyone has microplastics in their system. I would constitute this as a macro plastic. You don't, why would you? No, you cannot become plastic now. I'm gonna put this to the side. Okay. Um, I still haven't quite found the tech deck, so I'm just gonna whip out a magnifying glass real quick. I'll try my luck this way. Let's see um, what I can find. Okay. Um. Um. What is? Why would you eat this hat full? It's full. Why would you eat the hat? Right, 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 right. 
you needed something softer in your diet. Plastic was, you know, a little bit hard on the guts, right? Of course, no, it actually makes complete sense entirely. Um, have you spoken to a priest? Have you ever thought that maybe there's something inside of you that's craving your death? No, you've never considered it? Okay, okay. Um, what, how did you do in school? Yeah? Decent. Right? Okay. I'm just gonna take a little deeper look, see with this flashlight, see if maybe I can see something a little deeper in there. Uh-huh. No, yeah, I'm not really seeing anything more, honestly. You had a bowel movement this morning? How did that go? Oh. Oh, I see. Yeah. <laughs> so you did crap out the tech techs. Why would you visit the hospital then? You wanted to sh you you wanted to show how impressive you were to the to the medical staff. Everything that you can eat, it's like facing down death, showing us how we're useless because a creature like you can exist and avoid death, not needing the medical aid of professionals. I mean, it is just a Tuesday morning. Perhaps maybe you could, I don't know, calm down a bit. Okay. I'm gonna staple you up. I'm not giving you any anesthesia. Let's see how awesome you are now. And yeah, let's take it from there. Bandage that up a little bit. There you go. Right as rain. Okay. Next.